Today, I'll show you how to properly rename categories in WordPress. And we'll show you how to properly rename the categories without affecting your SEO. So to properly rename them, let's go over to posts and categories to see all the categories that we have. The easiest way to rename them is to hover over until we get the quick edit, like for books and change this to something else like ebook. So we can change the name here and you can also change the slug, but we recommend that you try not to change the slug because that is your URL structure. And if you do change the slug, then you'll have to set up a redirect so that nobody gets a 404 error when they're trying to go to your site. Then once you update the category, then you see that the name has changed. Now, if you're trying to get a little bit more organized, you want to add a description, then you'll need to go ahead and click edit. And this will bring up the whole category page for this one. Once you add the name, then you can click update. Now to change the category prefix, there's another area we'll need to go to. To change this, we'll go to settings. Let's go to permalinks. So you see, this is where the permalink is. This is the URL structure that we have chosen. We have chosen to use the post name after the URL. But then you also have a category base. And you'll see that if we have topics, then the category would be like your URL slash topics slash the category that we use. If you want to change that, you can change that here. If you make any changes, you'll want to do redirects. If you have something like all in one SEO installed, you can simply go to all in one SEO, go to redirects, and then you can enable that. And you can watch the whole video on how to do that by going to this video next on how to set up redirects for your WordPress website. And I'll see you over there.